Hey, what's good, brothers and sisters? How y'all doing today? So today we're going to talk about angels in the flesh. Yes, brothers and sisters, angels walk amongst you in the flesh. Now, the weirdest thing just happened. I just made this video and I uploaded it. And after it was done up uploading, it said file not processed. So I tried to re-upload it and they literally somehow... I don't know if they hacked my device. I have no idea what happened. This has only happened once before. But I can't even access the video that I recorded on my device. They made it unaccessible. So hopefully, God willing, this time I'll be able to get the truth to you. Now, so here we go. First, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you the so-called scientific theory. The anti-Christian doctrine is really what it is. I'm going to give you what scientists claim, and then I'm going to give you the truth, all right? So here we go. For as long as humans have existed, there have been eight common blood types, A, A, B, B, and O, with each having a positive or negative trait. These only, are, only vary based on the proteins found in each individual's blood. It is suggested that as much as 38% of the U.S. population has O-positive blood, the most common, while as little as 1% has AB-negative blood, the least common. Now, factually speaking, brothers and sisters, the AB-negative blood, that's the blood type of Jesus himself. All right? We know this because of the bloody shroud and a couple of other places where his DNA was taken and tested. Now, scientists are claiming that they have discovered a new blood type in humans that stems from an unbelievable source. You have to see what it means if you have this stuff coursing through your veins. The new blood type in question is known as RH negative. It's so rare that scientists claim people who have it could, uh, could have alien DNA. After performing studies, researchers found that RH blood does not carry the evolutionary gene found in rhesus monkeys that most other humans have, meaning they didn't evolve from the same lineage as other people. Now what they're saying is that RH negative people are aliens because they didn't evolve from monkeys. The theory, the anti-Christian doctrine of evolution is what they're speaking about. It says, an interesting new theory suggests if you have an RH negative blood type, you may have ki a kind of alien DNA. Studies show that RH negative blood types do not carry the gene originating from the rhesus monkey. Alright, now let me give you the truth, brothers and sisters. Chapter 105 of the Ethiopian Book of Enoch. If you want to read the entire African Bible called the Ethiopian Tawahido, you'll have to learn the Gez language. All right. Now, I suggest that you simply find someone who's from Ethiopia that speaks English who can help translate for you. Because there's many books written in English, but some books such as the first and second book of Dominoes is not in English. So it says, after a time, my son Methuselah took a wife for his son Lamech. She became pregnant by him and brought forth a child, the flesh of which was as white as snow and red as a rose. Red as a rose, white and red, that's ruddy skin tone, brothers and sisters. You'll find references in the scriptures, the authorized 1611 King James Version Holy Bible that says ruddy. I'm just pointing that out. The hair of whose head was white like wool and long and whose eyes were beautiful. When he opened them, he illuminated all the house like the sun. The whole house abounded with light. All right. And when he was taken from the hand of the midwife, as soon as he was born and taken from the from the mother, opening also his mouth, he spoke to the Lord of righteousness. Brothers and sisters, he spoke the minute that he was born. He spoke to God. Then Lamech, his father, was afraid of him and flying away, came he to his to his own father, Methuselah, and said, I have begotten a son unlike to other children. He is not human but resembling the offspring of the angels in heaven, of heaven. He, he is of a different nature from ours, being altogether not like us. His eyes are bright as the rays of the sun, his countenance glorious, and he looks not as if he belonged to me, but to the angels. I am afraid, lest something miraculous should take place on, the, on earth in his days. 
And now, my father, let me entreat and request you to go to our progenitor, Enoch. Enoch was the very first prophet, brothers and sisters. And to learn from him the truth, for his residence is with the angels. That's right. He lived amongst the angels in the flesh, brothers and sisters. When Methuselah heard the words of his son, he came to me at the extremities of the earth, for he had been informed that I was there, and he cried out. I heard his voice and went to him, saying, Behold, I am here, my son, since thou art come to me. He answered and said, On account of a great event have I come to thee, and on account of a sight difficult to be comprehended have I approached thee. And now, my father, hear me. For my son Lamech, a child was, has been born, who resembles not him, and whose nature is not like the nature of man. His color is whiter than snow, he is redder than a rose. The hair of his head is whiter than white wool. His eyes are like the rays of the sun, and when he opened them, he illuminated the whole house. When also he was taken from the hand of the midwife, he opened his mouth and blessed the Lord of heaven. His father Lamech feared and fled to me, believing not that the child belonged to him, but that he resembled the angels of heaven. And behold, I am come to thee, that thou mightest point out to me the truth. Then I, Enoch, answered and said, The Lord will effect a new thing upon the earth. This have I explained and seen in a vision. I have shown thee that in the generations of Jared, my father, those who were from heaven disregarded the word of the Lord. Behold, they committed crimes, laid aside their class, and intermingled with women. With them also they transgressed, ma married with them, and begot children. Brothers and sisters, we're going to take a time out real quick. And I'm going to pull up a new tab from the scriptures of the Holy Bible. Genesis chapter 6, verses 1 through 4. All right. It says, when human beings began to increase in number on the earth and daughters were born to them, the sons of God, the angels, saw that the daughters of humans were beautiful and they married any of them they chose. Then the Lord said, my spirit will not contend with humans forever, for they are mortal. Their days will be a hundred and twenty years. The Nephilim were on the earth in those days and also afterward when the sons of God went to the daughters of humans and had children by them they were the heroes of old men of renown right that's the giants when angels and humans breed there's giants now I'm just gonna explain a couple things real quick this is why an RH negative and an RH positive um, cannot breed together brothers and sisters if you are Rhesus monkey negative, RH negative, then you're an angel, and the RH positive is a human, and you're not allowed to breed, right? But there is a potion in the form of a shot, which can alter the DNA and genetics of the child while still in the stomach to prevent the child from becoming a giant. And without this shot, the baby is more than likely going to die unless God intervenes and he, and he changes the genetics himself. Because God can do anything, brothers and sisters. Now, here it says, A great destruction, therefore, shall come upon all the earth. A deluge, a great destruction, shall take place in one hour. This child which is born to you shall survive on the earth, and his three sons shall be saved with him. When all mankind who are on the earth shall die, he shall be safe, and his posterity shall beget on earth giants, not spiritual but carnal. Upon the earth shall a great punishment be inflicted, and it shall be washed from all corruption. Now therefore, if th th therefore inform thy son Lamech that he who is born is his child in truth, and he shall call his name Noah. Brothers and sisters, we're talking about the birth of Noah here. Noah was an angel, all right? For he shall be to you a survivor. He and his children shall be saved from the corruption which shall take place in the world. From, the, from all the sin and all iniquity which shall be consummated on earth in his days. Afterwards shall greater impiety take place than that which... Alright, look. This is chapter 105 of the Ethiopian book of Enoch. It ends saying, here ends the vision of the Enoch the prophet. So, I'm not going to read that entire thing, brothers and sisters. You get the point, right? 
So this is the origin of angels. You need to watch my video titled Truth About Christianity, which you were never told. And also the truth about targeted individuals for a greater comprehension of what's going on. Because this is very deep and, it's a, it, and to explain everything, I would have to make this video very long. So brothers and sisters, you, uh, many of you know that they put the truth in front of your face in movies all the time. Sometimes they give you a twisted version of it, right? Kind of like metaphors and parables. They don't give you the whole truth like I'm doing right now. They kind of give you hints, right? So in Marvel Comics, they say that the only human body that can support the power slash spirit of a superhero slash angel is those with the metagene. The metagene is RH negative DNA, brothers and sisters. The truth has been unveiled to you. It has completely been unveiled. You need to share this truth with everyone, brothers and sisters. All the truth in my videos, my, my channel will never be monetized, all right? It'll never be a for-profit channel. It'll never be incorporated. This is for y'all to learn and to share. I love y'all. You may be an angel unaware of the fact, you know? And uh, you may know an angel and not even know that you know an angel. So yeah, that's the truth. One love, peace, and fortitude. Hopefully this time they won't try to prevent me from getting this truth out there. Hopefully this video will load. One love, peace, and fortitude.